Y'all smelling that? They must be cooking something good down at Marcy Joe's. Let's see what's on the menu. Y'all come on in. Stay wherever you want. <laughs> hey, Mars. Did you ever notice that the end of each show that Roy and I perform, we always end in a kiss? Yes. It's disgusting, but yes. It's not disgusting. <laughs> we just celebrated <laughs> 10 years of marriage, so I'm we're still sweet. newlyweds. That's yeah, that's sweet. Yes. Mm -hmm. Well, speaking of kisses, today we're going to show you how to make our peanut butter kiss cookies. Yep. So cookies, you think, they're not that hard to make, right? Right. Mom right. made cookies. Everybody can just throw in a batch of cookies. But these cookies in particular, have a really nice ending to them because we top them all with the Hershey's Kiss. Yes. Now to get started with this recipe, we actually found this recipe just on the actual peanut butter jar itself. Everybody has their own favorite brand. My favorite brand in particular starts with a J, ends with an F. That's my favorite. But anyway, so I grabbed the recipe off of that and I, that's what I use. So we're going to have our peanut butter in here. We put about three-fourths cup of shortening. Um, you're going to add in three tablespoons of milk some vanilla. I think you do a whole tablespoon of vanilla. Jeez, that's uh, a lot of cotton picking. Oh, well, sorry. It's all right. Never can have too much vanilla. Not that much vanilla. <laughs> I don't always measure. <laughs> <laughs> then you're going to add, now this is a lot of brown sugar, but it's a cup and a fourth of brown sugar. And I think that's it for here. So we're going to go ahead yeah. and add this all together. Then you're going to dump in your flour, your salt, and your baking soda. And then you're just gonna add that all together, get it and nice and And then once that gets all added together, you're gonna add your dry ingredients. Mm -hmm. And this is kind of what it's gonna look like yeah. when you get it all mixed. Right, and you're gonna go ahead and put some out there on the cookie yeah. sheet. You're gonna make a Morris. cookie. Marcy, you can't make them that big. Okay, you can make them small. <laughs> sorry. She always likes them bigger. She thinks that to make the cookies it's bigger. It's beautiful. <laughs> Remember when I used to, uh, well, you used to make them actually in the morning. Uh huh. And I used to have oatmeal, and I'm like, Joe, I don't like the oatmeal because it's just plain. That's right. And I said, well, just add like a tablespoon of peanut butter. Right. And, and it's really then, good that way. And then one morning you were making them, and I was like, you know oh what? Gosh, actually, that's right. would be better, would be the peanut butter Hershey uh, Kiss cookies. And so that's what I did. It was the best oatmeal in the world. It was beautiful. Yeah, I noticed. It changed my life. <laughs> changed my hips. <laughs> yeah, oatmeal's supposed to be healthy. And then you throw yeah. in two of these cookies. You don't have cookies. to go this big, but it's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> now she's gonna dunk those in the sugar just like you normally would for a peanut butter cookie. That one's really a big marsh. <laughs> <laughs> but the Sorry. secret that we do, we don't like to mash them down. I mean, I know they like they look really nice with that little right. crisscross right. with your knife. But I don't like to do them that way just because it you makes let them, them flat. Yeah, they'll naturally, as they bake, they'll naturally kind of flatten out on their own. And I like to keep them just a little bit thick. And then you're going to put them in the oven for 350 and bake them only for eight minutes. Right. The timing is really, really important because if you overcook them, they're really, really hard. Yeah. They get crunchy. We like them moist. <laughs> yeah. So then you're going to take a peanut butter kiss after eight minutes. As soon as they come out of the oven, you're going to put this kiss on top and just smush it right there on top of the cookie. Yeah. And then these are what they're going to look like. You see Which how they're nice beautiful. and round? They're not too flat. They're not brown on the bottom. They're just perfect. But these are not going to look like that because they're going to be a lot bigger, fluffier. I made these. She made them. Do you think we can get somebody to taste these for us? Oh, yes. Actually, my daughter Brenda Lee is here today. Hi, Yay. Mommy. Can you come up and taste the cookie? How are you, sweetie? Good. There you go, huh? You want one of Mama's cookies? Yeah. Or Aunt Joey's, actually. Well, you make them too, though, Marcy. You make them pretty good. I know. You like them? Mm -hmm. Here, take one to your friend as well. All right. There Thank you, you honey. Mm -hmm. Thank you, hon. Well, there you have it, folks, our peanut butter kiss cookies here at Marcy Joe's, where we're changing lives one bite at a time.